No hit pack on this run and probably all the runs for the day just because we're shuttling. So I don't need as much water and it's not even hot, dude. Can't see anything. I'm gonna be a little cautious on this run just because the fog is uh, scaring me a bit. But I think it'll clear out throughout the day. I saw the sun peaking uh, as you get lower down into the mountain or on the mountain. I almost didn't want to wear goggles, but the um, the wind just messes my, with my eyes. I start to get all watery. They start, they start to get all watery. <laughs> Second half. Pretty rowdy warm up trail, if you ask me. I do love not having a hip pack. Feels amazing and free. <laughs> oh, man. Oh my goodness, <laughs> jeez. Ah, oh, dude, all this overgrown, it's like a, a whole different level of difficulty. Cause it smacks you around. I think here. I'm gonna go this rock. It's a better line. I'm shooting you out. Somebody said I should go left. Let me scope it out because I always go right. Mix it up a little. Thank you. Gotta handle with care because I don't know the lines here. Oh, that looks like a good line.
we decided to get one climb in on Meadows Trail. Sun finally came out. Have fun, man. Whoa. Very loose. Probably the loosest trail I've been on in this area. At least that top part felt pretty loose. There's like these little jumps midway through the trail and it feels better to hit them rather than to roll them. Just a smoother transition. this I, I feel like either I went down the wrong trail or smoothies has changed a lot since I ridden like this is a new trail How does that it's roller bro the right looks cleaner I'll hit it and then you just kind of mimic it is very slow just because I don't know where this trail leads. My bad, my bad. Let me scope it out. It is. That G out at the bottom is pretty hard, huh? That wasn't the trail we intended it to hit, so I guess it worked out though. Lovely day. I think we're just gonna call it. I'm lazy, dude. I'm ready to go home, eat some good food, celebrate this beautiful holiday. Thanks, my dude. Happy Independence. Yep. The first trail. I'm pretty stoked on the two new lines I took. The first new section I took was wrapping around, um, I believe it was like in the middle of the trail, rather than just going straight down and trying to make that left. That section is so steep that you're just going at it with so much speed, it's hard for you to, to, to turn at that speed. Versus going around, uh, it kind of catapults you into the trail. 
which I liked a lot more. You do have to kind of slow down to make that turn, but in my opinion, it's worth it because of how it shoots you out. And then that last part of the trail, instead of going right like I normally do, I went left, and it was pretty cool. It was just different. Uh, I wouldn't say it was let more or less rowdy than the rock slab. I think I had just as much fun. When I hit that trail, it'll just be whatever my preference is, you know, whatever I'm feeling that day. And the second trail was really sick. I had a blast. I think I will definitely have to hit that again, but just hit it a few more times to where I feel comfortable with it because I, I, I know myself and I feel like I'm going to forget <laughs> half of that trail. So I either make it a priority to go often to, and ride it or I take my time each time I ride it until I've got it ingrained in my head. But yeah, it was solid, good company. It was fun catching up with Reaper, chatting it up, getting some laps in. I hope you guys have a safe and fun 4th of July and I'll catch you on the next ride.